And today, a long overdue honor. The unclaimed remains of four Connecticut veterans were laid to rest with full military honors. News 12 Connecticut's Marissa Alter reports from the ceremony in Middletown. Oh, say can you see... At the State Veterans Cemetery, there's a solemn sense of honor, courage, and sacrifice. It's the final resting place for thousands of veterans, and another four join that number Friday. Present arms. We thank and memorialize PFC Robert Benson, Captain David Grower, Corporal Lauren Cubson Jr., Petty Officer Third Class Morris Meyer, for their service to country. These men's remains were never claimed from funeral homes in the state. They died without the comfort of family and friends, without being memorialized. But this public ceremony, presided over by State Veterans Affairs Commissioner Thomas Sadi, corrects that. We are all here together to remember them and to provide them with the military honors that they earned in service to our nation. Two of them were from Bridgeport, Captain David L. Grower and Petty Officer 3rd Class Morris Meyer. Both served in World War II. These brave men might well have been forgotten, invisible to Connecticut, but for our determination to say we will not leave them behind. This is the eighth such ceremony hosted by the Connecticut State Department of Veterans Affairs with the Connecticut Funeral Directors Association since 2009. The Connecticut National Guard took part in the honors. So did the Connecticut Patriot Guard riders who carried each veteran's cremated remains to the columbarium, laying them to rest after all these years. In Middletown, Marissa Alter, News 12, Connecticut.